here's a movie showing how you can add toolbars to embedded CAD. If you take a look in the workspace pull down here, we can go to the customize command. And what I'm going to do is just look up uh, what toolbars are available to add to your workspace. So in this case, I want to turn on one of my favorite toolbars, the MSIN toolbar. So all I've done is I've just gone in and I've looked at it to make sure that I see the exact spelling of that toolbar. And once I've referred to that, I can say OK. And then we type in the command dash toolbar. So it's a dash or a hyphen. We hit enter there. And then you can just start typing in the names of the toolbars that you want to add to the workspace. So I'm typing in MSIDN. I can hit enter. I want to park it on the left hand side of the screen. So I pick that. And I'll just hit enter for the coordinates. So note how it's been added. And it's made a little extra space here to park it. Now another thing that you can do if you don't want to go through them one at a time is if you go toolbar and pick on all instead. And then you've got a choice of showing or hiding all your toolbars. So I'll pick on show. So notice how each and every available toolbar gets added to the screen. And then I can just pull them apart and close the ones that I don't want. Or if I don't want to have that big mess there, I'll go to toolbar again. I'll pick all. And this time I'll tell it to hide. I hope that was useful.